Hi there! Welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm going to be reviewing the new Apple Body Mist from Bath & Body Works. Apple is part of a new collection that also includes two other scents, lavender and musk. I haven't picked up either of those, but I did smell them. And for lavender, I think the scent has a beautiful opening where the lavender is mixed in really well with that jasmine vanilla. I don't typically like lavender, and I think that on the dry down, there's too much of that here. So I'm passing on this one. And as for musk, musk is a milky, creamy rice scent. It's pleasant and seems like something that would be a good kind of your skin but better fragrance. But to me, I wasn't wowed by it. I'll probably test this out again though, just to be sure. And for the collection, each product has a number that corresponds with when you use them. So first you'll cleanse, second you'll moisturize, and lastly you'll miss. And now back to Apple. Apple has fragrance notes of apple, strawberry, and rain. And on the back of the mist, it says, create a custom routine to meet your lifestyle. And at first spray, I'm getting a sweet and tart green apple. It's juicy and smells like a sweet and sour apple candy. As the scent dries down, what I think is that rain note, it comes forward and mellows out the scent. And the apple now isn't sweet anymore. It's mostly a tart and spiky apple that tickles my nose. As for the strawberry note, I do get that when I smell directly from the sprayer. From there, I would say I get mostly a crisp apple with maybe 10% strawberry and about 10% rain. But after I spray, I'm getting apple. I do smell rain on the dry down of the scent, if I'm understanding what this note is. I think rain helps smell out the notes and help the scent become a bit rounder and smoother, but I still get that tart apple that has a hint of sweetness. To me, this scent reminds me of shampoo and freshly washed hair. It's like the kind of scent you get after blow drying your hair and where you can smell whiffs of the shampoo throughout the day, although apple doesn't have that good of a longevity. And as for comparison, apple reminds me of beautiful day. Both fragrances have an apple note. Beautiful day has notes of sun-kissed apple, sparkling cases, wild daisies, pink peony, and fresh woods, and smells like shampoo to me. But the difference is that Beautiful Day smells like a typical shampoo scent, whereas with apple, it smells like an apple scented shampoo. And for another comparison, I have this Garnier Anti-Frizz Cream. Both smell of apple, but the Garnier Cream has a strong apple note without the kind of spikiness that I'm getting with the apple from Bath & Body Works. I actually like the scent of this Garnier product more. I think apple would be good to wear during the springtime. It's a bright and happy scent. It'll also be good to put on the morning when you want something clean and crisp. If you like a fresh green apple scent, you'll probably like this one. Just note that as this dries down, the rain note does melt out the apple and smooth out the scent. Indoors, I spray maybe 14 sprays on clothing and I was able to smell it sometimes when I moved around, even hours later. I was even able to get a hint of it when I woke up the next day but it didn't perform well at all outside. I sprayed maybe five sprays before heading out and couldn't smell it after like five minutes. But maybe if you spray a lot more of it or if it's a hot sunny day where there's not a lot of wind, it might perform better. And as for combos, I tried apple with hot cocoa and cream. It's like chocolate covered apple. There's a cocoa chocolateness from hot cocoa and cream combined with sweet and tart apple. You get a yummy, somewhat healthy dessert-like scent. This smells delicious. It's a bit indulgent, but not too much. And I also tried it with warm vanilla sugar. And this adds a light sugary vanilla to that fresh, sweet and tart green apple scent. All in all, I really enjoy how fresh and clean apple smells. I might get more product in this scent. Maybe the body wash or the bar soap. Although their body wash has been reformulated and the new ones out don't seem to have much scent out of the shower. And as for the bar soap, I heard they're dry. So I don't know, we'll see. Anyways, that's my review of the new Apple scent from Bath & Body Works. I hope you enjoyed this video. Until next time, thanks for watching!